A superintendent scandal could mean a packed house at a board meeting tonight in Wayne Westland schools. That controversy started with a letter from a retiree. Now some say it's gone too far. 7 News reporter Kim Russell tells us why the district's leader is under fire. There's a really important meeting in the Wayne Westland Community School District tonight. If you take a look, there's a public notice up on the door, and I now have a copy of the agenda. Tonight, the board is going to take a look at putting the superintendent on paid administrative leave. The meeting scheduled for tonight comes after a retiree. Wayne Memorial Athletic Director Greg Ambrose gave the school board a letter. This is a copy of it shared by someone on social media with their notes. In it, he criticized Superintendent Dr. Shelley Holt, saying she created a culture of fear. Now Dr. Holt's attorney is firing back, calling the letter libelous. This letter uh, is, it contains a bunch of unsubstantiated allegations from our part, and we're trying to make sure that the process in evaluating Dr. Holt is fair and impartial. He says there are simple explanations to many allegations. For example, the allegation she skipped out on graduation. She was given permission by the school board president to leave graduation early to attend the graduation of her own son. We don't feel she should be uh, railroaded for, you know, having accountability. And that's what we feel is happening right now. This parent says he's outraged to see the allegations from a potentially disgruntled employee taken so seriously so fast. He wants the school board to be held accountable, pointing to this. It is a picture of school board trustee Fred Weaver dressing up in Dr. Holt's clothing and graduation cap without her permission. Hostile work environment to a T. They can evaluate their own conduct. It clearly, if people in the public believe that the superintendent is being disrespected, then they should take note of that. Board trustee Weaver says he put on the cap and clothes as a joke, and the issue is not unprofessional tension but the allegations in the recent letter. If you want to attend this meeting, it's happening tonight at 7 o'clock at the Stockmeyer Auditorium, which is next to Wayne Memorial High School. In Westland, Kim Russell, 7 Action News. All right, thank you, Kim.